people to another JVS review this time we are give, bringing you Rain Johnson's latest film Knives Out starring Christopher Evans Jamie Lee Curtis Don Johnson I'm missing some names here. I'm trying to think because I'm trying to be smart ah ah Daniel Craig I can't remember if I said Daniel Craig because he's the most important person to bring up in this cast also along with uh Anna Dale Armos, I think I'm saying her name right, Anna Dale Armos, who is awesome in this movie too. So, premise for Knives Out is a wealthy crime novelist, Harlan Thornby, invites his extended dysfunctional family over to celebrate his 85th birthday. The next day he wakes up dead, and when he wakes up dead, all hell breaks loose, and we get the investigation, because while it looks like he committed suicide, it is investigated to see if he really committed suicide or if one of his dysfunctional family members murdered him for his money. Sounds weird. Sounds kooky. Think Clue or any of those other 80s or 70s like mystery, comedy, funny whodunits. That's what Knives Out is. I think Rain Johnson is a genius. Never mind everything with The Last Jedi that a lot of people didn't like. I believe this man's a genius. This is an amazing movie. This is the best comedy this year, hands down. It's a top five film this year, hands down, but definitely the best comedy this year. Uh, Anna Dale Armos is great in this movie, playing uh, Christopher Plummer, who is the rich man who dies in this movie. That's not a real spoiler because he dies at the beginning of the movie. She plays his medical nurse slash assistant. Craziness, especially what she has to go through with the family. But then we also have Mr. Daniel Craig, who puts on his best Southern slash New York Southern accent that I've ever heard in my life. He is extremely funny in this movie very quick-witted comedy time in his down pack for those who may have forgotten that before he got the role of James Bond that Daniel Craig was an extremely versatile actor you're gonna see it in full display in this movie it is amazing again and then the rest of the cast is great you know uh Tony Collette Don Johnson Jamie Lee Curtis like all of the, Michael Shannon is in this movie too those main people play his kids like they're amazing in it. And then Chris Evans as his grandson. It's about time. I, I gotta applaud him here. I have had to sit through countless Marvel movies with little to no performances from Chris Evans. And then it took in this slight little comedy for him to act better than he did in any Marvel movie. Craziness here, man. Again, I don't want to say too much about it because it's a whodunit. And people, if you know what a whodunit is, you don't want to give away any tidbits of the plot because then it takes away from the movie from you i'll just say the movie looks beautiful it's shot beautifully the direction is amazing the cast amazing the storyline jesus jesus the storyline is great the 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 writing is a one on this project and it has to be again for a great whodunit your screenplay has to be amazing along with amazing performances because you got to keep the audience guessing the whole time you won't really see the ending coming and that's a great thing about it and it's a lot of twists and turns in the middle it's not a huge surprise but you don't see it coming because they kind of lead you to different directions the entire time again Rain Johnson's a genius Knives Out is an amazing movie um out of four stars I give it a solid four out of four I would say right now in a realm for best picture of the year I think we got Merge Story we have this, Knives Out, and I want to think of a third candidate, and it may be A Beautiful Day in the Neighborhood, because that's a really good movie, and, oh, I'm sorry, one skip my mind completely, which is The Irishman, which is probably going to win Best Picture, but, like, it's a four-horse race. Those are the four horses right now to me for Best Picture, and I am surprised. Going into Knives Out, I did not know what to expect of this movie, and for me to leave it and think, wow, this is 
one of the top four films of the year, without a doubt. It is the best comedy, without a doubt. It should rack up and go to Globes in that musical comedy section. Knives Out should win every one of those. It's that good of a movie. You're going to enjoy it. You're going to like it. Especially if you're older. This is clearly not a young spewing movie. This is not going to be for people, I would say, under the age of 25. But if you're 25 and above, especially like that 30 and above crowd, you're going to really enjoy this movie. The screening I went to, everyone laughed. It, it was more laughing in the screening of this movie than I've heard in any comedy that I've went to go see this year. Again, best comedy of the year. Granted, Booksmart is amazing, but this is on another level. So please check this out. Knives Out, Rain Johnson. This has been another JVS movie review. Peace, people.